Hey, welcome back to Survival Preparedness for Beginners. And today I want to give you a little tidbit of information that I received from the manager of a Sam's Club that I deliver to. The manager of the store. All right, folks, let me be clear on this. All right. Now, I went there for a delivery on Tuesday. It got there. Couldn't even get inside the store in, in the in the back room to do our deliveries. Me and the FedEx guy, we basically helped each other slide the stuff and stack the stuff inside the door that we go into because it was crammed full. The manager was back there because the shipping and receiving manager was off because he had a doctor's appointment. So she was back there trying to get all these goods in and out and trying to find some place to put all this stuff. She was actually waiting for a truck to show up that was gonna move one of these trailers that was already full of stuff because they have no place else to put it. The floors are crammed full and everything else. And she was waiting for them to move that and put an empty trailer onto the dock so that they could load a lot of those pallets and stuff inside that trailer to make room in the back room. Long story short, I asked her what was going on, you know, because the original receiving manager told me that they were supposed to be slacking off to give them a chance to catch up. And the products basically have doubled coming into the store. The manager said starting this weekend, July 4th weekend, they're going to start having a lot of mega sales that are going to be taking place on a lot of products. So if you people out there are looking for things, um, if you're looking for any type of survival stuff, because remember, anything to do with camping or anything else all goes into your survival supplies. And it could also be gas grills. I know they're having huge sales on gas grills right now. I just looked online. They're having huge sales on a lot of different products, furniture, TVs, electronics, um, all different types of stuff out there. Buyer beware though, because we just don't know how long that stuff has been sitting around and nobody is going to actually tell us the truth on that, on, you know, how long was this thing sitting in containers coming over here from overseas and, you know, we, di we just don't know. So, like I said before, you always just want to make sure that you are purchasing things from companies where if it doesn't work, you can return it and either get your money back or exchange it for something else. Now, something else to remember, this is probably going to be taking place at a lot of different box stores because everybody wants to try to jump on the bandwagon here because you have Amazon Prime Days coming up in July. So a lot of these major retailers, Walmart, Sam's, Costco, BJ's, Target, Kohl's, all these people are going to be starting to run mega sales to move all this excess products of being shoved down their throats right now from their warehouses that they have no control over. And they're going to try to beat these price sales that Amazon's going to have on its Amazon Prime Days. And they want to get ahead of it. And they want to try to take some of that money from Amazon. So depending on what you're looking for, you could be getting some really good deals. I'm going to have a video coming up here soon about what is not going to be included in these deals that are going to be rolling around for all of us. And always remember, folks, think twice before you buy. Is it a need or is it a want? Is it something that can help you out? in an emergency type situation? Or is it, yeah, you wanted that new uh, 83 inch TV that they got, you know, $1,000 off of right now at Sam's. The biggest thing is, is you weigh the two and see how it plays out for you. What is your financial situation? Do not go in debt because it's such a great sale. I warned you people in videos in the past that these are coming and they're going to make these deals so incredible, it's going to be very hard for you to say no and to turn around and be like, 
Well, we could use this or we need this. We need this in order to make sure that we can survive in an emergency type situation. It could be hurricanes, it could be floods, tornadoes, natural disasters, fires, floods, blizzards. Maybe it's stuff to keep you warm in the winter time. I don't know. Gas grills are a great addition to your survival supplies because even if the power and everything goes out, you can still go out and fire up that grill as long as you have enough propane to run it. Now they do have these like multi grills now where they burn, they can run on gas, they can run on charcoal, and they can run on wood. Yes, they do cost a little bit more because they're running on three different combustible fuels, all right? Because you have a nice wide range there to cover yourself. But in the end, would it be worth investing a little bit more money to get something that, in case you run out of gas, you can go to charcoal. If you run out of charcoal, you can go to wood. So, I mean, there's three different ways that you can cook with one grill. So, it's just to give you some ideas and just to give you a little bit of thought out there. All right. So, the inside information on the Sam Club's price cuts, it's going to be starting this weekend. They're really going to start ramping this up and they're going to be keep ramping this up right up until Amazon Prime Days because they all want a piece of the pie. And don't forget that this is also going to cover Walmart, Sam's, Kohl's, Target, Costco, BJ's. They're all doing it. They all want a piece of Amazon's pie. And maybe you can score on some of these great deals. So I'm Survival Preparedness for Beginners. Thank you again for joining me on this video today. I really do hope that you all get out there and do your shopping. Be diligent about what you are buying and think twice. Is it a need or is it a want? And how is this going to help me be prepared? So until next time, folks, I will catch you all on the flip side.